Good morning everybody and welcome to the Trade Talk podcast. Today most Asian stocks are trading down after Wall Street surged amid robust economic data that stoked concerns about a pullback in central bank stimulus. Treasury yields and the dollar held advances. The positive part of the previous session in the US was President Joe Biden may be willing to compromise on corporate taxes. In brief, global stocks are trading in tight ranges as traders weigh the economic recovery as well as risks from faster inflation. The monthly US payrolls report Friday could be a source of volatility if the data deliver a surprise. The Nifty is moving towards 16,000, setting a new record in a row. The Sensex is also preparing to reach its peak of 52,507. On Thursday, Titan, ONGC and Larson helped bring the Sensex and Nifty to higher levels. The Nifty has once again formed a bullish continuation formation and today we need to see that whether the market sustains above the levels of 15,600 or not. Today is a day of the credit policy and its outcome could be between 9.45 to 10.15 am. For the Nifty and Sensex, 15,550, 15,600, 52,000, 52,800 can support heavily. However, the resistance is close to 15,000 750 15800 which is nearly 5200 points higher from current levels and which is corresponding to the levels of 52517 which was the previous highest level for sensex so we may see those levels in today's date because it's a day of event and uh, the way there was activity in banks it was completely cautious sort of activity and whenever there is a cautious sort of activity and if the trend is overall bullish then we see most of the time gains so yes there is a possibility that after the announcement of the policy we may see one more jump in the market but yes for that we need to see that whether the market is opening a little bit lower or not if the market starts or if they open somewhere around 15,800 then there we need to be careful and after hitting the all-time highest levels on Sensex we may see some profit taking. So around 15,800 we need to be careful. Around 15,600 we should be buyer in the market and yesterday's closing was around 15,700 levels. Now uh, today we are going to focus on uh, uh, sectors like FMCG, pharmaceuticals and financials. Select buying is not ruled out. Escorts entered into breakout formation. It closed above the level of 1200, which is positive. Uh, technically, uh, it is indicating us that it is heading for at least 1300 levels, and we have a buy call on fundamentals on on the basis of fundamentals also. So it's a buy uh, at current levels, and uh, we can keep stop loss around 1180 for the same. Uh, other than that, uh, if we see the um, Activity in Bank Nifty, then Bank Nifty uh, was uh, around 36,000, uh, it was around 35,600 levels and 35,400 is going to act as support for it. 36,000, 36,400 should be the final level to watch out for and based on weekly monthly chart, uh, we feel that Bank Nifty should hit the levels of 36,400. So that's the next target that we are watching for. Yesterday, ICICI Bank, HDFC Bank closed at the highest point of the day and uh, based on their formation, we can expect further more activity in banks. That's all from my side and with this, I am ending today's morning podcast. Thank you very much for listening in. Have a great day and nice weekend to all of you.